my name is Mary and I'm doing another short demo for you on behalf of On at Fife, On Fife Virtual Library page for their Dia de las Muertos weekends with the family event. Today I'm going to show you how to paint a skeleton inspired design and again I'm going to keep it as simple as I can. So here goes. Now I've tried to do this so that it rhymes, just to make it a little bit more interesting. So here goes how to paint a skeleton. Today I'm going to show you how. So start by adding white over the brow, then round about and over the nose. You can see how the white grows and grows. Now I'm going to get my next head, which has been pre-prepared. This is the rhyming bit it's supposed to be. Then we'll paint black around the eyes. Try it out. I think that's very wise. With the edge of your sponge and a smidgen of black paint, blend in gently. That will be great. Then paint triangles on the nose like this. You'll need a steady hand to get a line that's crisp. Next we need a line from the temple to the mouth. Then, with your sponge, drag the paint south. Whilst the paint is on the sponge, dab along the lip. It doesn't matter if there's a wee bit slip. Whilst we're waiting for that to dry, take the sponge and dab above the eye. Then, with a fine brush, take a line from the corner of the inside eye. Take the line right up. There you go. Easy as pie. Now, we're going to paint the teeth. For this you'll need your white. So make the paint as creamy as you can. So they look nice and bright. The teeth that is. Place your brush along the lip to create the little teeth. They should stand out 
because you have the grey base underneath. And this is all you really need to create your skeleton face and with a little practice it will all fall into place. So, so there you are. I hope you enjoyed that demo and I hope you have fun painting skeletons on each other and have a happy Halloween and Dia de los Muertos weekend with the family. Bye for now.